Thompson, Fairhope, Alabama. I'm a self-taught artist. I, uh, I was an engineer for 30 years. Retired from that and went to my true passion, painting. And I have struggled for the last 15 years and developed a style and a technique that I like, which is a blend of, some would say, impressionism and, so, and uh, expressionism. Digital transfers from, uh, in this case, the Eric Overbeat collection, uh, with uh, special permission from the Doy, Leal McCall Rare Book and Manuscript Library of the University of South Alabama. And the idea is to try to get some of Oldsmobile brought to the forefront. and edges and those are tools they go off and apply their own techniques to. Sullivan. This is my wife, Margaret. Hey. hey. We're from St. Paul, Minnesota. I'm a potter making wood-fired pots, which have been thrown on the wheel, cut apart, reassembled, paddled, ripped, torn, pushed, cajoled, and all these marvelous shapes. We're always, always honored to get an award here at Fairhope.
Uh, Robert Jones, I'm from Alaska, Georgia. If you've never heard of that, that's the North Georgia Mountains. I do photography. David Curls, I'm from Fayetteville, Arkansas. Married to another artist, Christina Smith, who won Best of Show. I won Best of Category, which is a drawing and graphics category. I work in brass, mainly brass. Of Charlie Patton, he's an early blues artist. Yes. Over here is Robert Johnson, who's one of the early blues guitar players. But I find these old crates and then I work old guitars into them. It gives me places where I could create a deep shadow box and tell a story about an early blues guy. found this old tin type here in Fairhope, Alabama, two years ago. She's probably somebody's great grandmother here in this area. I took a picture, took a picture of her and scanned her and printed her on an old player piano roll. That's the paper. And up above that circle is another piece of an early uh, music box disc. So that's called uh, Fragments of a Melody.